Hey guys, it's Lenny here, uh, also known as Skate on the Minecraft forums as well as uh, here on Minecraft World Map. And today I'm just putting together a, a quick tutorial to assist you with uploading your world to the website and uh, getting that map rendered. Um, the process is fairly straightforward, but I noticed there are quite a few maps, uh, or quite a few worlds in the database that aren't getting completed, so I thought this uh, might help some people to uh, get through the process. And before I get started I just want to say that I have added this uh, new Google Plus One over here in the uh, top right of the page. Uh, go ahead and, and give it a plus one on the home page uh, if you're happy with the site and you use it. Or uh, even feel free to plus one uh, any cool worlds that you see or your own world uh, just to, to help the visibility and uh, get the site out there to more people. Uh, this really helps me out a lot. Okay, so on to uploading. As you can see, I'm already logged in, so we can uh, go ahead and go to the upload page. I'm going to be uploading a new world today, and I do have my archive already set up. So it's a zip file, and basically it contains, you know, the entire world save. So you, it's, I notice some people just upload level dot dat it's not enough I need the entire region folder which has all of this um, the players folder as well is very good because it contains uh, information that may be used in the future for uh, for additional features so just go ahead and zip up this entire file and that's what you're gonna wanna go ahead and upload so when I click choose archive it'll pop up the uh, list of files uh, you can see that it's you know it's, uh, limited to zip rars or uh, gzip tar files so you'll have to use one of those compression methods uh, so this is my file here I'm gonna go ahead and double click on that and so once you have it selected it'll show you the size uh, if you change your mind you can hit choose archive again pick a different file otherwise you go ahead click the upload button that'll start uploading now while that's uploading you're gonna choose a screenshot now, uh, if you've created your screenshot with uh, in Minecraft itself, you can go ahead and type in percent app data. That'll take you into this folder, uh, which is your app data roaming. You can double click on Minecraft and double click on screenshots, and that'll bring up a list. Now, I haven't actually taken a screenshot of this world, I believe. So we'll go ahead and use this one here, even though I don't think it's from this and you can go ahead and click upload on that so when you click upload on that you can see that it's going to be processing quite a bit quicker because generally your um, your screenshots going to be smaller than the world archive so once that completes it's going to load up and what you should see is the full screenshot here and over here you're going to see sort of a small uh, thumbnail of what your actual thing is going to be so you can go ahead and move this box around. You can drag to resize it if you want to uh, take a bigger picture. We're going to zoom in a little bit on this. And we're going to make it a little bit bigger. The smaller you make it, like if you really zoom in tight on one really tiny specific thing, the resolution isn't going to be as good. So th the bigger you make it, depending on the original file size, but generally speaking, the bigger you make it, uh, the better the screenshots gonna look on the actual site so we'll go with we'll go with this we'll leave it right here and we'll hit save screenshot nope there you can see this world file has completed so we'll go ahead and hit save screenshot and now we can give this a title so this is my family server this is just the server that uh, me and my family play on and I'll give it uh, a short little description and we will tag it with uh, a couple things now as you're entering these tags you'll see that uh, you know options do come up in terms of uh, what other people have punched in uh, basically you can enter anything separated by a comma though so you can enter serve a comma and you'll, and you'll see them all separate and generally you want to separate these tags so server, we got a pretty big castle in there. Um, we have nether support. Although, yeah, we have, um, we do have nether portals. Um, 
I'm not sure what else at the moment. So we're just going to leave it at that. We're going to hit save and there we go. It's been submitted to the queue. So when we go to the uh, process queue, you can see which maps are rendering here. Um, and when you scroll down, we're going to be at the very end. So I'm going to skip all the way through this to the very end, which is a very long wait. And there we go. There's the family server. So we're currently in the list. We're at the end of the waiting list. And things will be processed uh, in order that they are received, as well as by file size. So get the small ones out of the way. Um, that way they're uh, they're processed a little quicker and that's it for now so hopefully that helps you to uh, upload your videos don't forget to uh, give me a plus one on the uh, home page helps me out a lot and uh, thanks hope you enjoy using the site